The Akram path continues. Generations of gnanis to follow. I will leave behind me a generation of gnanis. I will leave behind me my heir and thereafter the link of gnanis will continue. So look for a living gnani. There can be no solution without one. I am personally going to give my spiritual powers that is Siddhis to some people. Do we not need somebody after me? Would the future generation not need this path? The one accepted by the world is the one. Dada, you say that there will be thousands of people who will mourn for you when you are gone but there will be no disciple. What do you mean by that? Nobody will be my disciple. There is no spiritual throne here. If this were a throne, then we would need a successor. You might try to become the successor as a paternal relative. Only the one who is accepted by the world will carry on this work. Only the one with absolute humility will be accepted by the world. The one who becomes the world's disciple will succeed. Generations of Living Gnanis All the people that have come here to you have come from Kramik path to Akram path. Each one of them has experienced this Gnan in their own way. Dada, the unique feature of Akram is that we have met the Pratyaksh Purush, that is, one who is present and living. After some time though, the Gnani Purush will not be present, right? Yes, you are right. Keeping aside the issue of those who have acquired the Akram path through your direct living presence, that is Pratyaksh, what about those who come to this path after you are no longer here? At that time, one will not have the opportunity to meet a Pratyaksh. Will he? There will be. Indeed, there will be. Everyone will have the opportunity to meet the Pratyaksh Purush? Yes, they will get it all. This will continue. Will it continue like this? It will continue. Do you understand? But is there not a need for a Pratyaksh Purush in the Akram path? Nothing works without the direct presence that is Pratyaksh of the Gnani. Yes, without his presence, it cannot work. Otherwise, this path will be closed. Otherwise, the path will be closed? Therefore, you will need a Pratyaksh Purush. I just wanted to hear this directly from you because so many times I have difficulty with people trying to interpret according to their own thinking. What Krupaludev, that is a Gnani Purush of Kramik path, Srimad Rachandra has said. I asked you this because there is a possibility of same thing happening with what you are saying. That is the reason I want to know whether Pratyaksh Purush will be available to everyone in Akram. For some time this Akram path will thrive. For some time? Yes, for some time. Because there is a group of people that have to be filtered out through this Akram path. Once this is done, there will not be any qualified people left and so the Akram path will end. This is only for the chosen few. Yes, for this group of people only. That is why you called it Akramic path. After attaining self-realization The Signs of Self-realization before you received this Gnan, you were Chandulal and after Gnan, you became Shuddhatma, that is pure soul. Is there any difference in your experience? Yes, Dada. Do you experience this from the moment you get up in the morning or in the afternoon? This experience is different from any prior experience. It is spontaneously present when I wake up. When you wake up in the middle of the night, what is the first thing you remember? I am Shuddhatma. Yes, when you spontaneously remember Shuddhatma upon waking up in the middle of the night, it is proof that you have realized the soul. Now, you have to follow the Agnas of the Gnani Purush. These Agnas are paramount. 
After I give you this gnan, the reality takes hold in you. Then you become a purush, that is self-realized. You realize that you are Shuddhatma, that is pure soul. I destroy your sins. I give you the divine vision, that is Divya Chakshu, whereby you are able to see Shuddhatma in everybody. After giving you the right belief and unifying you with your soul, I give you the five Agnyas, that is, cardinal principles. These five Agnyas will guide and protect you. Experiencing the Self Permanently How long do you remain in this awareness of I am Shuddhatma? When I am sitting alone quietly in solitary place. Yes. After this, what is your feeling? Do you at any time feel that I am Chandubhai? Do you ever really feel that I am Chandubhai? It has not happened after taking Gnan. Then you are Shuddhatma only. One can only have one feeling. In their daily lives, some people even forget their own names. There is no problem with that. Your state of Shuddhatma will remain for sure. But Dada, in the daily life, many times the awareness of Shuddhatma does not stay. Then, is it replaced by the awareness of I am Chandubhai? Say that for three hours you are not aware that you are Shuddhatma and I was to ask you, are you Chandubhai or Shuddhatma? What will you answer? Suddhatma. It means that the awareness is there all the time. Suppose a man got drunk and lost his awareness during that time. What happens when the effect of the alcohol goes away? Then he becomes aware of himself again. Similarly, external circumstances affect you. This has been said with strong conviction. If I ask you, are you really Chandubhai or are you Shuddhatma? You reply Shuddhatma. I ask you again the next day and you reply Shuddhatma again. If I continue to ask you the same question for five days and get the same answer, I know you have attained the soul. I have the key to your liberation so that even if you complain or protest, I would not listen. Knowledge through scriptures, knowledge through experience. The gnan that you have acquired encompasses the essence of all our scriptures. Whatever is said in the scriptures is correct. However, Akram Vignan is all that is above and beyond the scriptures. In the scriptures, they describe the soul, but all of its qualities and characteristics are not included. You are only able to acquire the soul because I give you its complete description. Whatever positive attributes you acquire in the Kramic path, you acquire only a corresponding fraction of the soul, but not the spontaneous awareness of it. One has to remind himself of that awareness in the Kramic path, but in the Akram path, the awareness is spontaneous and natural. It is there even when you wake up in the middle of the night. Things you have to make an effort to remember fall under the category of the body matter, that is Pudgal. You do not have to remember the soul. Once your real nature as the soul has been realized, you do not have to make any efforts to remember it. Establishment of Interim Government After Gnan, the state of Shuddhatma results. However, the state of Paramatma, that is supreme fully realized state, has not yet been attained. The state achieved is the interim state, 
the partially realized self or antaratma. What is the state of partially realized self like? This antaratma, that is partially realized self, the interim state of the self, has a dual role. One role is to settle the worldly affairs and the other role is to attain final moksha. That means to treat all your files with equanimity and meditate on the pure self. Dada Shri has used the term file for anything and anybody that you interact with after Gnan. Once all the files have been dealt with, the state of the Supreme Self or Paramatma is attained. The function of Antaratma is to deal with file number one, that is the worldly person Chandulal and other files. I am Shuddhatma and file number one Chandulal has to settle the accounts of all worldly files with equanimity. Is this only for those who have received Gnan? Yes, only those who have received Gnan acquire the Antaratma. Antaratma is the interim government. Once all the files have been dealt with with equanimity, it will result in a full government. Full government is the absolute self.